what's up welcome back to my channel today your girl having some i just whipped something together i got some jumbo shrimp ramen noodles uh and some boiled eggs and i have like a pink mascara right here and i have of course i have me a lemon some juices all over this that's what i'm going to do but I'm not gonna dig in. Look, I've got a little seed on here. I'm not gonna dig in till I say my prayer, of course. I also have this sauce, habanero sauce, that I might add in. You never know. Might, might not. Anywho, I'm gonna start with a prayer and then I'm gonna dig in. Amen. And amen again. All right, y'all. So let me. I got some, and some kimchi. That's what's in there. It's like, kimchi is like cabbage. So yeah, I like kimchi. When I first saw people like eating it on uh, YouTube videos, I was like, what in the world are you eating? Like, what is, what is this, what's going on? It looked like cabbage. So you look exactly like cabbage. But it got a little different taste. That's the end. This is the chemistry. Mm. Like a vinegary spice in there. But it's good. It's definitely good. We had a little, uh, party over here today for my dog. Well, yeah. My daughter had it for her dog. <sighs> mm. We never used to do stuff like that. But my daughter, you know, this has parsley oil on the ship, so I just don't with how big they are. On nice size. Yeah, but we definitely had a party for her today. I'll show you videos, where she got presents. Um, our cake. The cake definitely looked like it was a cake for her. I'm going, I can eat. My daughter made it by herself. You definitely did that. Hmm. That's so good. Whew. You don't hear any noise in the background? It's my um fan. Oh, I forgot. I got some chicken in here and some kind of, some vegetables that I cut up. Number one fit. Number one fan. That's my husband's my number one fan. Anywho, look, got vegetables in there. Vegetables and carrots, corn, like vegetables with uh, string beans, carrots, corn. Mm. And shredded chicken. I'm with it all. I love to eat. The dog had her eight. She's a cane corsel. A huge dog. And my daughter really loves her. When we first got her, a lot of people wanted to make their cane corsos with a butt. My husband is like, no, uh uh. Nope. I guess you let mother trust people to do it. But 
the dogs would have been in our care because she's the girl. But he just was like, so we're protective. No, we can't do it. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. When you first got that dog, I was mad. You know why I was mad? Because I wanted the dog that never grew. That's when we went to the shop. The dog shop to go get. And it never works out as planned. Went in there. There was so many cute dogs. The one cute dog that would never go that I saw. And it had no signs or nothing on it. But guess what? It was already sold. The owner just had to pick it up. <clears throat> I'm like, I can give you money now, cash money right now. Like, can I get the dog? I was like, no, they made a commitment and they had to do what they had to do. He was some people that put half of their money down. They didn't say nothing about that. They loyal. So I know if I ever get stuff of them, they ain't gonna stop. Unless there's other reasons, but. What is going on? I ain't talking the whole ride home. I was just furious. Stop. I think it's been a couple days to start really talking. <laughs> now mind you, she was a, a big puppy. She was a puppy. She just was a big puppy. Her paws was like, they were big. But my dog, my, I'm saying all this to say, my daughter really loves that dog. And she's getting old. So that's why me and my husband was like, we wish we had uh, made it her so it could be other puppies. Because if, so if something happened to that dog, she's going to uh, lose it. We already talked to her and told her. But kids don't want her that. She's eight years old. Came for herself. Eight. She's been with us the same amount of time that, almost the same amount of time, that I've been in my house. So. She's been rocking with us. <clears throat> it's the people, these people coming knocking at the door. And if they feel like being beat, she was scaring them away. Scared the heck out of them. Excuse me, sir. <clears throat> Excuse me. Do you have time to talk what? about our. I ain't going to stop them because this way. You probably shouldn't have been there anyway. On certain people. Hmm. That chicken. My vegetable is so good with this. Hmm. My whole plans tonight was to eat a shrimp and egg boil, but. I added some ramen, some chicken, some mixed vegetables. I did it all. Added it all to it. Mm. It's so good. It is so good. Mm. I ain't been doing videos a lot because I have been working a lot. 
work overtime. And when I do come home, it's time for me to take my daughter, for me to take my daughter to practice. There's just so much going on. I'm definitely gonna catch up on these videos. Mm. And I am that I will do. Oh, can you see? Yeah, uh, another shot. Oh, you can't fall. Sure. Mm -hmm. Anyway, she spoiled the, the puppy. This dog now. This dog is a grown woman. She was potty, potty trained really quickly. So. She's a good dog. Really good dog. Mm. And so other dogs come around and she wanna drool heavy. Like really heavy. She might come around and sniff them. And then walk away from them, like get away from me. She's like a bougie dog. That's what she was, a bougie dog. sitting on the side like you want to take some you want to drink some of me you just doing all eating I worked over today Ooh. I think I worked over every day I've been just killing them working over I'm trying not to stop because once you stop you can't do it no more for a while I'm not trying to get in that late and lazy mode. I know my birth and what I'm capable of and what I can do. Sometimes I wish y'all can come through the camera and taste it. As well as smell it. Because your girl be doing her thing in the kitchen. I promise you. I've been doing it for a minute now. I pretty much learned on my own. Like, back in the day, my uh, stepdad, he used to cook. I learned like macaroni, big mac and cheese and all that stuff. Sometimes, but he used to put bacon, ham, stuff like that in his. I just made the regular mac and cheese. It'd be so bad. His was banging too. He was doing that down south stuff. Because we used to always go visit down south. I was a kid. And they cook like that. The grandmother, like, they go out there, get the chicken, do all the stuff. I was trying to eat it. I 
I really enjoy myself now. Mm. What I want to do to be a kid again? No bills. Mm. Free the room. Whatever. Not whatever, but. But. Until your mom said, or dad said, get your butt in this house. I miss that. Had my little teen line. And that teen line stayed on my phone. I had that teen line. I still remember the number. I used that number for everything. I had that teen line since I was 13. That's what I wanted for my birthday. Once I left, the line got left with my sister. My sister was wiling out on there. Hmm. Oh, I was like, I'm turning that phone off. Yeah, everybody calls it. I mean, everybody. Me? I used to sneak and try to use it after, what's about 8 o'clock. Cause my mom was like, 8.30, it's time for you to go to bed. Nowadays, these kids be like, can I stay up to 10, 11? I wish I would've told my mom back then. Can I stay up to 10, 11? She be like, girl, don't play with me, I'll be done rearrange your face. Like, calm down. Why you wanna, <laughs> why you wanna rearrange my face? Like. <laughs> I'm going to lift your spirits. <laughs> Those parents was different back then. Their words spoke volumes. Like, <laughs> what they said, they meant. And don't ask them again. Don't say what you say, Mom. Don't, don't do it. Just act like you're here and be like, mm, and just keep on moving. Don't play with them. Because you ain't about that life. <laughs> the old parents will whoop you in front of Everybody was there, and then they got friends on the sideline rooting them on, and they want to whoop So, there was no but way you was getting out of that angle. You, you live, you no, get out no way at all. Oh, well, I am full. I'm tired. I'll go work another day tomorrow. Next day, next day, next day, next day, next day. But anywho, I stay half, half of a double today. I just stay over. That wine is good. This one put me to sleep though, because wine usually put me to sleep, so I'll be sleeping for you know it. Anyway, y'all, I'm about to actually end this video. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And turn on y'all post notifications so you know when you're up for the next video. Until next time, see ya.